Today is the final day on the job for Temple University's President Jason Wingard. After mounting pressure from several university groups, Dr. Wingard submitted his resignation earlier this week. Our Jasmine Payu joining us live from Temple's campus this morning in North Philadelphia with more on what's next, Jasmine, for the university as they look ahead. Good morning. Good morning, Janelle. This is certainly a transitional time for the university as they look ahead to who will be the next president. However, Wingard's resignation putting to the forefront issues faculty and students say they've been having for some time now. Now, as you mentioned, Wingard submitted his resignation last week since being hired in July 2021. Wingard has faced growing scrutiny for his leadership. Concerns include a 42-day strike of graduate student workers, the first in the union's history, the shooting death of Sergeant Christopher Fitzgerald, and his stalled plan to move from his Chestnut Hill home to a home on campus. This was in the wake of violent crimes near the school. Students we spoke with say they were not exactly surprised by the news. I think at the end of the day, like all the decisions end up like, you know, he's the president, he gets the final say, so he does have to take accountability for everything that happens on campus, um, even if he's not involved in every single decision. I think there's like a larger institutional problem like within the city of Philadelphia. And so while I think, of course, there's always a better move that somebody could have made and uh, like more police, more funding here and there, it's like there's a huge problem. And like pinpointing it all to one person and the small group of people that run the campus is like, it, it's, it's a jump, I think. I'm optimistic that this new leadership, when whoever it may be in this new administration, can move us in the right direction. I'm optimistic for the future, but I think that it's the first step is acknowledging that there's a problem. In a statement, Temple's Faculty Association says while President Wingard's resignation is a step in the right direction, his departure does little to address the structural issues in governance at Temple University. Now the university says the board will designate a small group of Temple senior leaders to guide the university as they look forward to who will be the next president. Jim Janelle, I'll send it back to you in the studio. All right. Thank you for that update, Jasmine. We'll wait to see what happens there.